Hi, this is Jim Anderson. I just wanted to give you an encouragement about the future. Uh, coming from uh, Daniel uh, chapter 2, verse 29, where it says, As for you, O king, thoughts come to your mind while on your bed about what would come to pass after this. And he who reveals secrets has made known to you what will be. You know, in the, in the first half of the 20th century, uh, the uh, American, you know, our government and the courts decided that insider information, uh, trading, uh, you know, on insider information in, in the markets uh, was illegal. You know, just think of uh, of the advantages that it ha that you would have in having that kind of inside information about what's going to happen in the future. Um, you know, in this, in knowing these, you know, what's happening inside of these companies before everybody else does, you can kind of get a good idea of what's going to happen to their stock prices. And so, on that information, you could make a lot of money. Well. That was the kind of knowledge that the prophet Daniel had, uh, you know, and it was not on his own. It was by virtue of his relationship with God, and uh, we see that in Daniel two twenty-seven and twenty-eight. Um, Daniel foretold to the king of Babylon, the existing king of the world, that his kingdom would f would fall, and be followed by three more and all those kingdoms would be replaced by the kingdom of God in heaven which is in Daniel 2 verse 44 Daniel didn't reveal this information to profit from it personally but to cause Nebuchadnezzar to humble himself before God who you know, removes kings and raises up kings which is from Daniel 2 verse 21 we may not fully understand and know everything that the future holds but we can put our trust in God the one who is in charge of the future and we know that he has good things planned for us so we can move forward in obedience to him knowing that um, he has a good future in front of us so remember that as you uh, may become anxious about maybe what the future holds for you. God bless, and we'll talk to you soon.